What's up? How are you guys this week? We are down here at Frankie's True Age Meet on yet another Monday. And as with every week, we have a bunch of stuff to talk about. This is actually the first time uh, one of my main workers has called out on a Monday. The guy had a couple emergencies this year, but uh, this is actually like the only time that it's been Monday, which is, you know, the busiest day. And it's actually Christopher Columbus. You guys like the tape in the background? It's actually a bit quieter in here because I put some plywood on the condensers on the freezer, but still pretty noisy. Uh, so I'm lucky that UPS is open and the post office isn't because I didn't check. So if UPS is closed, then we just don't ship orders because, you know, if I did come down here and I didn't check and UPS was closed, then we would have been in a bit of a pickle. But uh, Frankie Boy does not get in pickles. I mean, I'm a little upset uh, for personal reasons and business reasons. One is, uh, I got some blood work last week and my liver is uh, it's doing better, but it's looking like it's gonna take a lot longer to, to get healthier and feel better. You know, I was hoping it was gonna be really feeling better around now this year, but even next year, I don't know if it's gonna happen. Uh, Business-wise, uh, the meat is getting harder and harder to, to get, you know, stuff that I could normally just order like the next day or whatever, it's taken weeks. So yeah, as I've mentioned several times, I really needed to get that slaughterhouse to get this business going, but um, since that didn't work out and it's looking like I'm not gonna be able to get bank loans um, I might have to do uh, Come up with some other creative business ideas in order to fund that if I ever decide to do it But uh, let's talk about what's going on. So last week I mentioned we're gonna have the pemmican and some freeze-dried ground beef in stock Unfortunately, we couldn't do only beef and beef fat to make like a plain pemmican It just wouldn't go through the the bar machine with the texture we had so we just have to do the flavored pemmican. Blueberry, honey, beef, and beef fat, which is, is delicious, it's good. I'm gonna sell this batch at a discount because uh, the recipe isn't perfected yet, but it's still very, very delicious. So hopefully we have the labels in by the end of this week for the blueberry pemmican. And uh, then I can also uh, have the freeze dried ground beef available for sale next week. So this batch of pemmican, I'm probably gonna sell at like three or 350 a bar, but in order for me to actually sell the bar, it's gonna have to be a bit more, probably around 450. Uh, the freeze-dried ground beef is going to be at least forty to forty-five dollars a pound. I have to double-check the math on it, but this stuff is isn't cheap because freeze-drying a product gives it twenty-five percent of its original weight. So you have to imagine, okay, you know what's the price of regular ground beef? Multiply that by four or five, and then you have the equivalent of freeze-dried ground beef. So it doesn't seem like a lot. For, for what you're paying for, but that's that's the cost of making it. Uh, so we got a delivery today of just some clay for the Frankie's Naturals products and some hypoallergenic gloves that I have my guys wear with everything. Uh, they made some water key for yesterday and you guys bought all of it insanely quickly at $8 a bottle, so I had to increase the price because we just sold out instantly. Uh, so we're gonna stick with 10, maybe have to go back up to 12. And the price of this water key for was originally $15. And, and that was the price that it was like worth it for me to lose my mind making this stuff down here. But we got the water kefir back in stock, uh, maybe 30 or 40 bottles right now. It's probably going to sell out uh, by the time this video is up. Of course, the whey protein is always with the Flextrose 100% organic glucose product. We did run out of chocolate best bars, and that means that we're probably going to run out of berry and vanilla too. So my guys should have time this week to catch up on making those as well. So even though we're out of the chocolate best bars, I might just have my guys uh, make uh, some pemmican instead and then we'll launch the pemmican this week and then restock on the best bars next week. Uh, this guy for the dehydrator was supposed to come, but he didn't come last week and he wants to take a look at it tomorrow and try to fix it. However, the Chinese warehouse is back up and running so I can buy a control panel for 500 and they want like 350 to ship it. So I think I'm just going to buy the new control panel from uh, China and I'm going to have fun looking at what it was supposed to be wired and what it's wired as now. So let's just go through the freezer real quick and I'll show you guys what's missing. So we're basically out of the sirloin steaks because of the promotion. I wanted to give away the um, my special burger blend, uh, but I don't have enough to give it to everyone. I might do it anyway, but we'll see. Uh, the main thing that was back in stock last week is the beef belly. So we have a ton of beef belly, uh, cut up into one pound portions as well as whole beef belly uh, which you guys bought out really quickly uh, we got a lot of ground venison back in stock as well as the skirt steak back in stock which we ran out of now unfortunately there's no more lamb brains and I can't get any so I'm not sure if we're gonna have it back uh, you know 
in a few months or next year. So I'm completely out of uh, portion brisket. I'm completely out of lamb brains, two like major products that we sell. Uh, so you know, again, banking on that slaughterhouse sale was uh, not only for increasing the profit and doing vlogs down here and just getting a, an incredibly larger customer base. It was because I'm literally unable to even source products now. But you know, there's nothing else to really show you guys down here. Yeah, so we're kind of running low on almost all the cheeses besides cheddar. Uh, so I'm probably going to order some more this week. Uh, I guess we'll go downstairs real quick and uh, just take a look at some stuff. Just a quick update on, on the other businesses. So organ supplements, I'm working on kind of restocking and building up everything if I do decide to take a break. Um, I'm going to put everything from these into the smaller boxes and just have everything nicely labeled. We already did that with most of the uh, beef powders. You know, we have the full spectrum organs back in stock. Uh, the big brain is back in stock. And I said, you know, we're out of lamb brain. So if you guys do want to buy uh, freeze dried brain powder, and then we have the uh, third eye supplement as well uh, back here, which is the, the brain glandulars. So we do have that available since you guys no longer have access to the lamb brains. Wi-Fi shielding is somewhat organized. We have everything in these two pallets. I might do some winter clothes for you guys. And Frankie's Naturals is over here too. Uh, I gotta uh, make some more deodorant and then maybe some lip balm and then I should be good to leave, I guess, for a vacation. Just a bunch of random stuff I need to organize because my parents are complaining I have too much stuff in the garage. And uh, I think I showed you guys this already. This is the computer setup that we have. I have to clean up some stuff in here, but uh, you guys like my chair? I thought I was being cute sitting on this because I'm sitting on a box that actually contains the chair I'm supposed to put together, but whatever. Now I got in really late today because of like insane traffic and I was losing it, like people driving like lunatics. Uh, so uh, I want to wrap up this vlog and, and try to get some work done today, but I'll probably come in tomorrow. You know, I'm just going to feel a lot more comfortable once I kind of restock everything, what I think we're going to need for a few months and then uh, basically be good to go. Maybe I can escape the, uh, the New York winter for a little bit, but if you guys have any questions, please let me know. Uh, I'll let you guys know via email when we have uh, the pemmican and the freeze dried ground beef available for sale. It'll probably just be the pemmican first. Uh, I think the marrow bones are supposed to come in this week, but I don't know yet. Uh, we'll see. And hopefully I can uh, continue to keep this going before I completely lose my mind. So. Thank you guys for joining me today. If you could please drop a like on the video, leave a comment down below, share this on any social media you have access to, and you can check out frankdestefano.com to see all of my businesses, including Frankie's Free Range Meat. Uh, so thanks again for joining guys, and I'll see you for tomorrow. If you have any ideas on what you guys want to see for a whiteboard video, uh, just let me know.